What is up guys? Welcome back to another video. It's your girl Carmen Estella and today we've got another mukbang. <laughs> Welcome back y'all. I'm so happy to have you here today. So today we are doing another mukbang. We are doing Mama Appetite's cheesy, creamy um, chicken pot pie egg rolls, y'all. Go check her out. I'm gonna leave the link in my description box. Um, she made this a few days ago and I seen um, Big Guy Appetite as well. He ate, um, he ate them and it looked so good, y'all. So we're gonna, I'll see if I need some hot sauce cause I forgot it, but I wanna try it without hot sauce. And um, I've got five of them here. Um, and I'm so excited cause I made some for my family as well so they'll they'll try some all right guys so if you guys watched my last video thank you thank you so much i truly truly appreciate it and if you guys are new to the channel welcome my name is carmen estella and i love to eat on camera um and tell you guys stories and do fun things like that so uh i literally just made this i'm pretty sure it's steaming hot so let's get um our water started got some water here Okay, so just in case it gets messy, let's take a bite and look, y'all, it's so crispy. Oh, this is gonna be such a treat. And this is the sauce that she made, so. O-M-G. I don't need no hot sauce, no nothing. Oh my gosh, y'all. Hot. Hot. You guys. So growing up, I wasn't a big fan of chicken pot pie. I didn't really like the, like it, the microwave foods. I didn't really do that. Like I wasn't a big fan of like TV dinners and all that stuff. So. I was like, you know what? I don't know if I like it, but when you make your own from scratch, look at all that cheese right there. It's just, it's hot. You guys, please go make this. Oh my gosh, Mama Appetite, these creations. These creations are so fun. They're so fun to make too. Mm. I would have never thought about this. Chicken Popeye egg rolls oh my gosh oh my gosh there you go guys take a little bite with the with the sauce So, <clears throat> I'm gonna tell you on a minute. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. 
So y'all, did you hear about that YouTuber that started an OnlyFans page? She started an OnlyFans page and her first um her first picture was of her as a three-year-old, like, naked. Y'all, go look it up. She even has, like, an apology uh, video, too, now. Apologize. Like, what in your right mind? Uh, why? I wish I was like a shrink so I could really talk to people and pick their brain. Like, why would you think that that was okay? And clearly something must have happened to her when she was younger to think that that was okay. So yeah, y'all, I was I love watching Jason Lee gagging, gagging with Jason Lee. So I was watching that, I was watching him and I, or else I wouldn't have known. Mm. All I can say is poor girl. She's probably just lost. You know, she doesn't like she's just I don't know. I don't know what else like she don't understand like she probably don't know what's going on in the world nowadays. That's all I could think of. There are way too many weirdos out here that are, you know, just, I don't know, you know, I don't know. Because obviously she's older now, so it's not like, you know what I mean? I don't know. Like, why would you do that? Y'all, please leave it in the comments. Why do you think someone in their right mind would do that? Or maybe she's... Maybe she's not in the right mind. Hmm. Another thing I saw, I'm not sure if he's a priest or like a therapist or counselor, but this is, um, it's this gentleman that's talking like having people call in and talk uh, talk to them about why they're not in relationships and all that. But one girl called, she was pretty. Um, you know, obviously, I guess it was because she wanted a six figure man. And he, all he was doing was really just bashing her on why you will never get a six figure man because of how you look, you're average, you're not good looking, you're not, to him, she wasn't pretty. And he, he was telling her pick a number except for seven. And like, it was just, it was funny, but I don't think it's really his fault. I think it's the people's fault calling him knowing that he's going to talk to you like that. Like, you should know. You know what I mean? Like, just be ready to be bagged on. You know what I mean? And I know you guys don't get annoyed with the um, the bites. A lot of people want to see every bite. You know what I mean? I don't even need the hot sauce, y'all. Mm -mm. Now I am getting full. These things are huge. Like my dad makes empanadas all the time and my limit is two. That's all I could do. We're gonna get get into one more. Um, 
What other hot topics was I hearing about? Mm. The restaurant owner that was cussing uh, damn near the whole restaurant out. Um, I know y'all seen that. That that was viral. Um, I do understand him, but at the same time, why are you playing turn up music? You know what I mean? But I do I would also say if you was like at Nobu or like another nice restaurant, you would not be doing that. And this was a nice restaurant. He, I mean, it's not comparable, obviously. He's a new um, new business owner and this is a new upcoming place, but you would want your place, your establishment to turn out like that and it's by reviews. So imagine if people came over, excuse me, and said reviews and you was over there, you know what I mean? People over there twerking at your um, establishment. Mm. Mm. I can't wait for Tommy to try this. I really can't. Some Tabasco would be good on this, like the acidity, because it's so creamy. The boys are at the park, so I had some time to put this together, go to the grocery store, run around, run some errands. Mm. I will be making this again. Mm -hmm. This will go perfect with the um, a bowl of pop, uh, chicken pot pie. Because you get that crust, you get that. Mm. Mm-mm. What a little treat. <clears throat> but yeah, you guys. Um that's pretty much the few topics. Um, rest in peace to Wendy Williams' mom. Um I, I felt like she was very strong on that um uh, on her um show to talk about it. And I even teared up a little bit. Mm. <clears throat> I teared up a little bit watching it, so rest in peace to her mom. And um, <clears throat> yeah, prayers for her and her family, you know? Mm. Mama Appetite did it again, y'all. This woman throws down. I made her cornbread for Thanksgiving. It didn't come out right. I think uh, my tablespoons or uh, teaspoons, I think I got it mixed up. But anyways, um, it was still tasty, but then it got really hard. You know how, um, I don't know. I'm not much of a baker, y'all. So that's that. Let me throw that out there. But I think it was, it, it was me. I messed up in some, in some way. Um, So creamy, y'all. Definitely go try this. But anyways, you know, yeah, y'all. So I will see you guys in the next video. I love you guys so, 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 so much. Like I always say, take care of yourself and your mental health. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.